Hello everyone, my name is Rafaela Carolina Silva. Uh, I'm a PhD candidate at University of São Paulo, UNESP, Brazil, and I developed this paper with my professor Charles Oppenheim of the Hobbit Garden University, Scotland, and the professor Rosângela Formentini Caldas uh, of UNESP, Brazil. So the title of your paper is What is a Hybrid Library? Evidence from Scotland in Brazil. So we start this discussion take, talking about uh, that according to the United Nations Educational Scientific and Culture Organization, UNESCO, uh, many countries are going through major change of traditional structures of culture. Uh, an example of such a shift is the development of so-called hybrid libraries, defined as libraries in which traditional and non-traditional churches and information and entertainment are merged and integrated. Uh, the, term the term hybrid can mean several things in a library context, other than that of the hybrid library. The term has been used, for example, in relation to hybrid library professionals, example, processing several skill sets. Libraries tend to combine an academic and corporate purpose or a library and museum purpose. Use of hybrid instructions methods, example, online and face-to-face. -face. Or a library that combines public and private spaces. A uh, library and a theater, for example. Reactions of libraries to hybrid open sex. Example, article processing charges or not. And the hybrid professions, combining different skills cities, sets. Uh, so the article aimed to study hybridity within Brazilian and Scottish public libraries. Understand that management of these libraries is controlled in different ways because of the fact that the economic and the political backgrounds of the two countries are very different. So in Brazil, we study the São Paulo Library, BSP, and Parque Vila Lobos Library, BVL. BVL. Uh, in Scotland, we study the Central Library of Dundee and the Central Library of Aberdeen. We try to understand the similarities and the difference of between these two cultures. The study was carried out in 2016. We examined the product and service offered each unit of work on press processes with their community and they proposed to hybrid in each, each institution. Uh, we carried out an on-site survey, personally visited and observed the case study libraries, also interviews. The research was qualitative, descriptive, exploratory, and comparative. Content analysis was used to establish the best categories to explore data identified by the literature review about the similarities and differences between hybridity concepts in the structural environment of public library. The content analysis was made manually, and the pre-established categorization identified those aspects that characterized, characterized the hybrid libraries in their way of acting in the public sphere. Based on literature review, the indicators that guided the, the interviews in both countries were others in libraries' ability of visibility and understand the characters of social changes. Employees and users training in the use of hybrid libraries to adapt them to this context. Social inclusion actions, the interaction between technology, physical structure and email character, and the community development actions, as well as accessibility. We used interviews, participative observations, and questionnaires. In the initial data collection phase, 
interviews and observations were carried out in the basis of the comments of Pinfield and Oppenheim and Smith, Smithson. The interviews were to the director librarians of the library's choosing. Uh, talking a little about the Scottish Library's studies, uh, the Central Library of Dundee is the responsibility of the Leisure and Culture Dundee, part of local government. A part of the wider community, the library has strong links with culture, sports, and leisure, which brings opportunities for joint projects, working closely with Dundee City Council and other agents, including social work, earlier years, education, cancer support, and Department for Work and Pensions. The Central Library of Aberdeen, created in June of um, 1,192 offer public access to PCs for 51 adults plus 84 children. Information resources include books and online resources. The library is a member of the Scotch Library and Information Council. The Brazilian Library study uh, about these, the libraries composed these this amount is that BSP was inaugurated uh, a few years ago with the aim of encouraging a, and promoting a taste for reading. It is located in, in the north zone of Sao Paulo. Its st structure was designed to offer comfort, autonomy, and attention to its patrons. Uh, the BVL, also inaugurated a few years ago, occupies a big area. Uh, inside the Villa Lux Park, uh, west zone of São Paulo. The collection constantly updated the Fox on literature and environment issues. Finding and discuss of the researches. Uh, the story identified some necessary elements to be present in hybrid libraries and shows the difference between public hybrid libraries in Brazil and Scotland. These uh, elements are future improvements, employees, users, collection, internal design, external design, local information management, and external information management. It's important also to say that exploring ten, training, career, career development, and lifelong education is very important. Our, our relevant indications were noted on on more times in the Brazilian public hybrid library study. The social aspects presented here are different in the previous literature, where the concept of hybrid library was more focused on the convergence of technology rather than the needs of local regions. From the perspective of Scotland, all the indicators were also present in the Scotch library study. The Scotch libraries are working with social aspects, again different from the previous literature of hybrid libraries. Oh, so this figure shows us uh, the indicators, how how these indicators was working, how much these indicators was working in each library. So in Brazilian libraries, you can say uh, these indicators are working less than Scotch libraries. So, uh, Scotch libraries this more development in mainly sociocultural approach. Um, this figure shows us how hybrid can actuate in these places. So, we saw here hybrid team and the, that is expands to official users contents infrastructure physical structure information access accessibility social inclusion research and management so each part of these have different works to be um, to be worked so 
I can see here official, we can work with volunteers, skill gaps, workshop, learning needs, uh, potential viability, personal development, training, and continuing education. In the user's context, you can see user training, distance learning, change needs, involving user's community, user's study, lifelong learning, and digital site sensitive. Infrastructure, with, we have open access, agreement between libraries, special materials, available services, remote access, and the address is baseline. Physical structure, we can work with digital serves, materials, saving locals, signing, layouts, special environments, and print service. Information access, we can we have to work, we should work with Kikri, Wi-Fi, print information, open collection, and digital information. Uh, accessibility, we you focus on moving staircase, ramp, special equipment, spaces between rows, service delivery, and elevator. Social inclusive projects, we, we work with digital inclusion, library programs, partnership programs, and mobile AP. With social management, we see print publications, shared collection, acquisition forms, and e-publications. So we can conclude that Brazilian libraries focus on products and service on the promotion of online libraries, mapped environments, photo galleries, extensive activities, social radio projects, projects of public utility, resumes, research and investigation. The Scott libraries focus on centers for research collection and view hybrids as a convergence of digital and print services. With the Scotch libraries we study are involved in library networks that work together, the Brazilian libraries tend to work in isolation. In your view, this lack of networks is a major cause of the poor development of Brazilian public hybrid libraries. By working together, Scotland libraries gain the strength to achieve their goals as they use of their human, material, and financial resources to reach the goal. On the other hand, when an institution works alone, it depends on location, its own resource to reach a goal, and this naturally interferes with the quality and time of production of servers. So there is too much misleading information to claim about COVID in circling on social, me social media, blogs, and the websites. In the crucial role of public libraries now to improve information literacy and the ability to recognize what is reliable information and what is not. We argue that hybrid and public libraries can exist the remote link between the libraries and the users, contributing to the computerization of the population at the time of COVID limitations. The small sample assignment may not be typical of our libraries in the UK and Brazil. A further limitation of the study is that it relates specifically to public libraries. It, not, it does not include, for example, university, school, and or special libraries. The study has not considered other countries, which may well show very different results. Recommendations Future research could seek to both expand the number of libraries study and inspire library professionals to understand the role of hybrid in public libraries, as well as their awareness of the implicit factors which influence the concept of hybrid libraries. So here you can see the reference used in the slides. And thank you so much for watching this video. If you have some questions, you can send them to us. Uma caminha pequenininha só para falar top, ele brinca aí.